Alatao MP Charles Abel took the opportunity to pay tribute to the founding father. It is a very sad day today in Papua New Guinea. It is a very, very sad day here in, uh, in Millen Bay. And I also take the opportunity on behalf of the leadership of our province and the administration and all the people of Millen Bay express our sorrow, deep felt sorrow and condolences to the family of uh, Sir Michael Thomas Somare, the father of this country, this beautiful nation of Papua New Guinea, this young nation who passed away last night around uh, midnight. And we are all, of course, in deep uh, mourning. And that is the shadow that is hanging over this occasion here today and across our nation. Australian Prime Minister Scott Morrison has, on behalf of Australia, extended deep condolences to the Somare family and the people of Papua New Guinea on the passing of Grand Chief Sir Michael Somare. The Australian Prime Minister said Sir Michael was a towering figure in the history of Papua New Guinea. Passing of Sir Michael Somare, the first Prime Minister of Papua New Guinea. He is, has been, over the course of his amazing life, the champion of the sovereigns, sovereignty and independence of the people of Papua New Guinea. I consider the people of Papua New Guinea our family, always have. I have been in contact this morning with Prime Minister Marape James, my very good friend, and passed on to him and to Lady Veronica our deepest condolences and sympathies for the Papua New Guinean people. There will be great mourning across Papua New Guinea, from the lowlands to the highlands, to the villages, to the cities. Sir Michael was an extraordinary man of his generation. He was the light of his generation, which has lighted up the path for Papua New Guineans today and into the future. And so I just want to honour him in his passing and reaffirm Australia's great friendship, more than friendship, our family relationship with the people of Papua New Guinea. New Ireland Governor Sir Julius Chan has expressed deep sadness at the passing of his close friends and ally. Sir Julius sent his condolences to the Samara family in a video sent hours ago. Sir Julius served as the first Deputy Prime Minister in 1975.